and thus we return to the totalitarian state that is the Beholder games. Hello you and welcome to some kind of Fox content and welcome to now Beholder 3. Uh, in the last one we finished Beholder 2 and we already played through Beholder 1 or at least we got as far as we could in that game. Um, so now we are uh, heading into the aptly named Beholder 3 and I'm kind of excited to see how they went about with this game because as I said when finishing Beholder 2, um, I liked the game but it didn't feel like a Beholder game, it felt more like a spin-off to the uh, Beholder series. Um, so I am excited to see what awaits us in Beholder 3. I mean we're still dealing with the totalitarian states and whatnot but uh, you know the gameplay from Beholder 1 to Beholder 2 I felt like was really different. So is this going to be something different again? Or are we going back to Beholder 1? Are we continuing with Beholder 2 gameplay mechanics? I don't know. Um, but it's going to be exciting to see. Now, I am getting a little concerned though. Not, not necessarily with the Beholder thing. But the only reason why we're playing Beholder is, as some of you know, my computer died. I had something else scheduled, uh, Beholder wasn't scheduled for a little time at least, um, but then my computer died and then I had to uh, plug in my old computer and find a game that I could run and record seamlessly on my old computer and that's how we got into Beholder in the first place here, um, so sudden at the channel. Um, but we are now playing the third and final installment. I know there's a spin-off, but that hasn't come out yet, um, so we can't play that. But this is the final installment. I have yet to hear anything about my new computer and how likely it is to get fixed. Well, it it's gonna get fixed, I know that, but it's just when. Um, hopefully soon, because um, I'm down to the final Beholder game. And I don't know how long it will take to finish this. If we finish this before I had my I have my old or my uh, new computer fixed, um, yeah, then what? Then I have to find another game that I can run on my old PC and record. Um, so yeah, uh, fingers crossed that do behold the three that we hear any news about the computer and hopefully get it back. Um, I don't know. The only thing I know is that now we are heading in to behold the three. June 3rd, 1989. Great Leader City, the Greatest Union. Oh. Yeah, that can be good. If we're in the city of the Great Leader. Well, did we dispel of the Great Leader in the second? I don't know. Oh, oh that looks menacing. All Frank ever wanted was a good job, a family, and a nice place to live. Oh, good for you, Frank. And good for Frank. He had all of this. Hmm. But having everything and losing everything are often close. Wait, what do we have here? This doesn't belong here. These are not Frank's files. Who messed with Frank's computer? Now, quite frankly, that's just rude. Ha! <laughs> Did you get it, Frank? Because, you, yeah. Okay, space. Frank opened the suspicious file. Okay, I see I'm being told. Are we playing the Stanley Parable all of a sudden? Can I move the mouse? Nope. Resisto. If someone sees this, Frank will be in some real trouble. This needs to go. Do I actually need... Frank? Oh my god. Okay. We're utilizing the keyboard. Well, we were in the other games too, but this is a whole new way of utilizing the keyboards. And I think resisto means resistance. I'm gonna delete. <laughs> and it almost looked as if he made it. But he didn't. Ah, well. Nothing stays unnoticed in the ministry. Well, is the Ministry a museum by now, or is this a different one we're dealing with? Nothing. Oh, poor Frank. Frank oh, Jesus Christ, my eyes. Trouble. Ah! And the only way to get out of it was to sign a deal. What if I don't press space? 
What if I click like G? I had to sign it. That ain't doing anything. Cool. What if I press delete? Nope. Backspace? Control Alt Delete? Okay, let's Frank just uh, uh, shut up. Find a piece of paper. I Frank Swatch hereby agree gladly and of my own free will to offer myself to the greater state as a devoted informer and humble servant. Glory to the great leader. A deal with the devil. And so Frank's days of having everything are over. Aww. For now. A new beginning. Okay, so I see we're still in the 3D... Well, are we? No, it lo uh, the 2D space of um, Behold the 2. No, th wait. No, this is actually more to... It seems like a mix of Behold the 2 and 1. Hi, Mr. Police Officer. I got mail! Can I look at the mail? Why can't I look at the mail? Hello? Oh, well. Hi. Cool. What are you doing? Where... Where... What are you doing? Where are we here? I think you just answered your own question there, Frank. Wrong question, Swatch! And wrong grammar. Uh, not grammar, but grammar. The right question is, where are you not? Well, I see you answered in earnest. <laughs> Did you get it? Okay, with the... Uh, you are not in the mines, you're not in prison. And why not? Ah, because... because I didn't do anything. Always the same excuses! In the past, traitors like you would have been shot, Swatch. Nowadays, we're just too nice. But times will change again. Why is my family here? They already fired me. Please, let's go home. Yeah, come on, Ernst. Let's go home. This is your new home, Swatch. Gone are the days of the privileged suburban home. Ah, but... Oh, you'd rather go into the mines, you say? That can be arranged. Okay, I'll shut up. So follow me. Use the... <laughs> Use the connected control device to navigate Frank through the world. That's the first time I've seen it set like that press and hold the run button to get the, to the destination faster what is the run button controls okay hang on oh that's the run button okay well e wait no 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 i what okay freak it let's do it i don't know what it does but flagpole half hoist flag Oh, they... Oh, no. Someone died? Well, that's not good. Can I not diss him? Why can't I diss him? It says I have a mail. Also, my family is over here. I can't talk to him, can I? Nope. What is this? Da -da 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 -da. Da -da 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 -da. Looks like my ghost is running in slow motion. It looks like my ghost is, is uh, auditioning for, um, for Baywatch. No, when they ran down the, uh... Oh, we do have a 3D space in this one. Um, when they ran down the beach. And it was all like, do, 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 do. Well, that's not it, but... Wait, is that my potted plant for bribes? Fiddle leaf thick. Well, fiddle the day, we're gonna go back and collect bribes from people. That's gonna be good. Modern ministry flag, white flag, light blue flag, dark blue flag, a flag made of black fabric. Modern ministry, ministry. You know what? Can I take this? Go. I'm gonna hoist my colors here. There we go. Up, Sedessus, you go. 
half hoist like. Yeah. Hoist like. There we go. I did it. Hi. <laughs> Peekaboo. I'm right here. Welcome to our your new workplace. We'll make you the property manager. <gasps> oh, we return to that, do we? You will take care of the tenants and the facilities of the house. Your work starts right now. The washing machines need needs regular main, maintenance. Here, take this D scaler. Get to work. But I'm a civil servant. I'm good with forms and with letters, uh, with paperwork, not with household appliances. And I hope you learn quickly, Swatch. Otherwise, they are the mines. You can shovel coal with your bare hands too. Good day. But I... Windada. I'll be waiting. Snood. Interactions. You can interact with most of the objects in this world. They, these are highlighted with a border. In different in interactions... If different interactions are possible, a menu pops up and you can select the desired in interaction. Use the menu to access your inventory, current directives, and current tenants. Hang on. Hang on. Don't worry, I'll work in a second here. Oh, I can't do anything here. Okay, 124 and 254. Keep that in mind. Oh! Uh. Wait, what? Oh, right, that's what he gave me. I was like, where did I get this from? Can I go in the closet? I can't. Oh, <gasps> we're gonna be planting cameras again and they go to level four. Um, okay, so. Ha. Huh. I'm gonna search it first. Everything is empty empty around here. It's like my head. Okay, let's gotta let's get to fixing here. There we go. I'm not a handyman, but I could do that. Hi. Cardboard. The washing machine is... Uh, the washing machine is clean again. There you go. Physical labor never hurt anyone. The machine was in such a desolate condition because your predecessor did not clean it regularly. My predecessor? Where is he now? In the mines. Follow me, Swatch. Oh. I got a hundred dollars for that. Oh, we're gonna be rich. Hi. Your duties also include regularly emptying the garbage container and refilling the central heating system with heating oil. Do you need an invitation? I'm supposed to do what? Empty the dumpster here. Refill the heating oil in the room next door. And do it today, Swatch! All right. Duties. I probably manager Frank has to empty the garbage, descale the washing machines, and repair the heating system every day. If a blah symbol appears above the appliance, Frank must take care of it. For this, you need descaler or heating oil. Select the appropriate icon, like the gears or the garbage bag, to complete the activity. Okay. Oh, I gotta take out the trash. There we go. A heavy smelling garbage bag. Bring out. There we go. Got a hundred dollars for that. I was severely underpaid in uh, the whole first game and a lot of the second game. So it's nice to see I finally got like a like a big payout now. Heating oil. Cool. Hi. I'm done. Not at all. All you did was empty the dumpster and refill the heating oil. You're done when I say you're done, Swatch. Come on. You're done. Ah, did you get it? That's a joke of mine. <laughs> I'm walking faster than you. Get wrecked, dude. Now what? No, oh, I'm going here. Oh, what are, what are the ghostiness and the such? Well, what films do I have? I have none. TV set. Why is that taken up by someone else? Why does it, it have this icon on the top right? It's a TV, it's not my, my child. Well, I guess some people treat it that way. See, now we're talking. Socks. Yes, let's take that. And alarm clock. There we go. Perfect. Can't do anything else. Why does it say two here? 
Oh, probably because this uh, if I click number two, then I can... Uh... Yeah, okay, so that's how it works. The standard shirt of the greatest union, practical and inconspicuous. I know I didn't mean to talk to you. You and your family will live in this spacious and beautiful apartment from now on. The great leader really means well for you. Too well, if you ask me. Now you must be wondering why did you get why you got such a nice place and how you could possibly have earned it, didn't you? The answer is you didn't deserve it. Prove to us that you deserve it. <laughs> didn't me this? Uh, didn't me that? I'm talking to a man who's wearing a hat. That's the best I got for you right now. I'm, I just woke up. Shut up. I was just thinking that our old house looked much nicer. Excuse me? You even have a television here. You used to get a set like that only for special achievements, and you still had to wait 10 years. Come with me, Swatch. Frank's apartment. This is Frank's apartment. This is where he's... The Swatch family spends most of their time. Frank can rest on the couch in the living room to fast forward the time. In the back room is Frank's office. Oh, see, now we're, now we're getting into the nitty gritty here. See, this is what I want to do. I want to get the shirt. No, shut up about, about the office. In Frank's office, you can find the work desk, the telephone, and the secret ministry mailbox, the houseplant. The phone can be used for incoming and outgoing calls. You know, that's pretty handy for a phone. At the work desk, you can write reports, create profiles, or even blackmail someone. Oh, we're going back to Beholder 1. See, now we're talking. Let me get this shirt. Yoink. Can I put can I put this on? Hang on. Inventory. Can I? Nope. Okay. I want to check everything before I do something else. Look, there's the other sock I was missing. Now I have a pair. I have here nothing. Hiding place. Ooh, so there's a hiding place be behind the photo here. Or painting. I don't know what you want to call it. Is this the bed again? I thought this was the cupboard. Oh, there we go. Sweater. Can I get some pants? And a newspaper. Cool. Still need pants though, but is this the same? I think this is the same. Yeah, okay. A uh, lamp, nothing else. Uh, nope. Okay. Do, 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 do. Hi. But I keep saying hi to you. I'm sorry. So, this is your realm, too. We will make you the property manager. That is the state landlord of this house. That's more like it. There's a desk here, after all. So, I'm not just the janitor. You will not only take care of the facilities of the house, but also the tenants. Both are your responsibility. If someone has a cold without you knowing about it, your fault. If someone in the house gets out of line, it's your fault. If someone starts a revolution in your house, it's your fault. Oh, I'll keep that in mind. But didn't the great leader in his wisdom command to the first reforms? Reforms don't make me laugh. Things will soon change here again. You are the best example of where this dangerous decadence has led us. You're going to help us get this place back on track. We'll keep an eye on everything here in the house. In wise foresight, I have already sent you three surveillance cameras. Please take them discreetly from your office plant. If we want to send you something, we will deposit it in the plant. So check back regularly. So now install one of the cameras each in the smoke detector of the laundry room, the boiler room, and the garbage room. Pooftas. Pooftas. I think so. Pooftas. You aren't supposed to think you should install the cameras. Frank's house plan. Frank has a house plan at, at his workplace at home. This is often used by the ministry employees to send Frank important items. Take good care of the plant and check regularly to see if you have received anything. Okay, I'm gonna make a call. Hello, dial number. <laughs> Dang. 
stock then the Mr. Miller does not seem to be in, in the office. Well, technically he is, just not his office. Uh, I don't want to call. Can I make a report on Miller? Blackmail profile. Rent, rent. Oh, I can see. Ulrich Weinitz. Wolf Henker. Walter Bullhauser. Magnus Herman. Elizabeth. Ida. Alfred. Alexander. Kim. And Sabine. Okay, I got a lot of people to take care of already. In the last one, we only had like two apartments rented out. Or three, even. Okay. Three level one cameras. Cameras are used for surveillance and can be installed in fire alarms. Click on the fire alarm and then on the camera icon to install the camera. The camera can be removed if you need it somewhere else. Click on the trash can icon to remove it. Okay, cool, cool, cool. We already got all of that. Whoops, I didn't take all of the... Uh, yank. There we are. Okay, let's get going here. Let's get back to installing cameras so we can spy on the people. Do, 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 do. Here we are. And then a... I'm gonna see if I can not use my mouse for this. It seems a little more convenient just using the uh, the keyboard. Install your first uh, camera. Seems familiar. Achievement unlocked. There we go. Can I zoom out? Yes, I can. So I can like keep uh, tabs on everything here. My family is still out in the cold. What's up with that? Wait, V. Oh, that's a lot easier. Speak, kitty. I put the surveillance cameras in place. Bralata. Then activate the monitoring mode now. Wandada, Find a citizen who is acting suspiciously and record their behavior. Bralata. What are you waiting for? Surveillance mode. You get a clear overview of all installed cameras in the surveillance mode. This shows you all installed cameras at a glance. Press the eye icon to enter this view. You can click in individual rooms to watch residents more closely. Oh, hang on. So if I click V and then we click like here. What are you doing? Huh? What are you up to? Gained information acts strangely. I mean, they're just having a rave in the basement next to the garbage. In that, why, why is that? Okay. Ernst, I have something to tell you. Stuk, boy. I recorded the suspicious behavior of a citizen. Finally, so you know everything you need for the work here. By the way, you can also dismantle the cameras should you need them somewhere else. Make sure that the interior of the house remains in good shape. Pay the bills that come in and manage wisely. And most importantly, Keep an eye on your tenants. You alone bear the responsibility if someone here is out of line. And what if I refuse to spy on these people? We have your signature on a declaration of readiness, Swatch. With a single call, I can make you disappear into the mines forever. Okay. Become an obedient cog in the system, Swatch. And nothing will happen to you and your family. Do you understand? I think I understand. What if I have questions? How can I reach you? Don't call us. We will call you. Will you call me when I have a question? Okay, well. Take care of your family. Talk to Sabine. Okay, before we move on. Here's the question. Should we actually try to be just crooked? Really help the totalitarian state? No, actually, okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna play it as I normally would be trying to be a good person and then messing everything up. That seems like a me thing. And then if we die too quickly and we have to start from the beginning again, like we did in Behold the One, I will make a pledge to the totalitarian state. I will follow their every, uh, every rule and every directory they give me. I don't care about the people then, then I only care about the state. Okay. Hi. Uh, you're not her. Dad! I was just about to chill for a bit. Anything urgent? Uh, how are you, Kim? Good day. How are you, Kim? Did you settle in? I'm okay, but what about you? Why do you look so glum? 
Have you been fighting with mom again? At least you're in a good mood, Kim. And no, I didn't have a fight with your mother. Are you comfortable in the new apartment? I'm fine here, dad, don't worry about me. Of course, the house was better and the school and everything, but you know. And the people here don't talk to me and look at me funny. But I'll be fine, dad. You've got enough to worry about. Finally, a family that freaking understands me. Are you sure? Is there anything I can do to make you feel more comfortable here? Well, tell me, Kim. What do you want? I feel really misunderstood and alone sometimes, don't we all? I'd really like a pet. Oh, you want a dog. Dog, dog, dog. Do you want a dog? I'm not sure if your mother would agree. Well, then she can move out. No, no, not that big. More like small and cute. You can get small and cute dogs! Oh, don't tell me this is a cow that wants a cat. Oh, here we go. Okay. Uh, what about a guinea pig? A colleague's daughter had a guinea pig. They're supposed to be cute. Dad, I'm not a baby anymore. I'd like a rat. Oh, very symbolic. Well, it's not really original, but I don't want to say how disgusting. Well, that also seems kind of rude, but... You really are an unusual girl, Kim. You've known I was different from other girls for a while, right, Dad? Rats are really cool animals. Social, smart, affectionate. A lot of people are prejudiced, that's all. Please, Dad, I want it so much. Well, at least it's not a dog. Oh, shut up! But where am I going to get a rat? Just, I mean... Look through the sewer. You don't exactly get them at a pet store, do you? I think you do. I think I saw one behind the washing machines once. Excuse me, rats in our laundry room? No. I think so. Why don't you take a look? You bet I will. And I, if I find one that don't that doesn't bite me right away, you can have it. Thanks, pops. That really means a lot to me. Oh, what a good little talk. Hi, Ulrich. Good day, missus. Hi, yo, what's up? Uh, excuse me? I'm asking, what's up? Uh... <laughs> I love this. The sky. Ha, ah, did you get it? It's just one of the deals we pull around here. Ha, <laughs> very funny. First class. My name is Frank Swartz. I'm the new property manager and landlord here. Ah, you're the janitor. All right. So I'm kind of responsible for the rentals and many other things. Yes, all right. Petit Bouchon. Oh, Bouchons. I can't say that, but I can't. Uh, what do you want from me now? I want to introduce myself briefly and ask if everything is all right with you. Nothing's all right. Everything sucks. The whole system is shite. But you don't look to me like someone who wants to change something about it. I'm trying. So you think the whole system is shite? That's interesting. What exactly is bothering you? Dude, don't you think it's... Do you think I'm stupid? I know you're a snitch. Inform somewhere else, dude. Have a nice day. Great talking to you, I guess. Ah, another person. Magnus. Uh, good day. Would you have a moment for me? My name is Frank Swatch. What do you want from me? May I ask you a few questions, Mr. Herman? If you absolutely have to. I'm the new property manager. That's not really a question. Are you? See, that's a question. And how do I know that? Do you have a property manager's license or something? My family and I live in the caretaker's apartment. There's your license for you. You must have noticed that we just moved in and haven't seen anyone else for, the li for like two minutes since we moved in. So how don't you know that? Ah, yes, maybe. So what do you want from me, Mr. Property Manager here? My name is Swartz. Why are you so sus? You look sus. You could be... Be an enemy of the system? I'm not an enemy of the system. I'm the caretaker. If you say so. And you? I'm not an enemy of the system either. I'm glad to hear that. And what do you do? This, that, 
Is that well, well, very interesting. Sean. Yes, incredibly interesting. But that's enough. I have something important to do today. Bye, Magnus. He's very rude. Ah, oh, bye. But oh, the phone. Hi, wife. I'll t Whoa, the game is teetering. Uh, I'll talk to you in a minute. I have a phone call. Hunter. This is Frank Swartz. Why does it take so long? Stark. Sorry, I was just out and about in the house. Anyway, now you're here. The office has an assignment for you. Oh dear, but better than cleaning machi washing machines and taking out the trash, I guess. Well, that depends on how you define taking out the trash, cuz... Listen, Swatch. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to imply. I'm telling you, the mines would have been be a better option for you. I'll shut up already. What do you want me to do? Talk to the residents of the building. That's why it took so long. So what are you complaining about here? I didn't mean to yell at you, sir. Get to know them. Gain their trust. Once you learn about people, create profiles of your tenants on your workstation and send them to us. Understand? All right. Should I pay attention to anything in particular? Or should I just... Click. Report everything? I guess so. Uh, there are... People who want something from you, these are marked with a blah symbol above their heads. Many tasks are given to you over the phone by a ministry employee uh, assigning you a task. Failure to complete tasks can have harsh consequences. It is highly recommended to complete the task from superiors in the given time. We will call you task completed. Okay, 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 let's talk to the wife. Ah, oh, Frank, what do you want? Uh, how do you like it here? Honey, are you starting to settle in a little bit? Ah, settle in? Here? It's terrible here, Frank! But honey, it's not that bad now. The washing machine only washes clean every other load. There's mold hanging on the walls and then there's all your electronic junk in the apartment. Who's the building manager around here, huh? You really don't like the new apartment, do you? Ah, no, it's terrible. The kids hate it too. Kim and I just fight all the time. If it weren't for Alexander, I would have gone mad long ago. But I guess we'll have to put up with it. Even if the apartment is on the first floor. I think it's quite romantic, actually. Romantic? Romantic! What is supposed to be romantic about this place? I mean, there's flowers on the table. That reminds me of our first apartment together. Back when we were both students. Remember? I tried to suppress that memory, Frank. Shortly after our wedding. That was cute, wasn't it? You haven't forgotten that, have you? Of course I remember. We had to get married to even get an apartment. That's the only reason I married you, Frank. And we partied every night, danced all night, drank bori and whiskey. Yes, yes, that was nice. And then Kim came. Everything changed with the children. And today the career determines the life, well, at least my life. Oh, honey. Ah, don't do oh, honey me. Your dismissal is already bothering me. Speaking of weddings, you still remember the gift you promised me for our anniversary? Oh, uh, yeah, uh, which is in May, April, June, August, yeah, uh, the moving chaos has pushed that aside a bit, but of course I'm thinking about it, and it's the thought that counts, right? When am I going to get it, Frank? I just need to get it quickly. I'll be right back. Don't go away. I'm just going for milk and cigarettes. Frank, you joker. Sometimes your forgetfulness is even cute. The stores. You have different ways to get items. There is the kiosk from which you can buy legal items. There is the stranger, the black marketer, uh, marketeer. From whom you can get illegal items. He only appears at night somewhere next to the apartment building. Wait, do I have the drug that keeps me awake? In addition, there's the guard Max Musterman in the ministry who can get you special accessories and the lunch lady who sweetens your day with foods and drink. Is that Serena? I hope it's Serena. I like Serena. Hi.
Father, what is it? How do you like it here? How do you like the apartment, Alex? Have you settled in a bit? It's fine, Father. The old apartment was better. There was more sun. And I had my own room. All my friends were there, too. Uh, uh, did you make new friends? I know you miss your buddies. Have you made an, any new friends in the house? No. There were only Ida and Alfred, father. From the second floor. Alfred is too small and sick all the time. And Ida's a girl. Ew, cooties. She doesn't even play soccer, father. So how's school? <laughs> oh, you're great at school, Alex. I have to cram a lot, father. They are much more advanced here than at the old school. Can you explain to me about the hypothenuse? Yes, it's the noose I'm gonna strangle you with if you're gonna get me to do your homework. So what did I say? Nothing. People what? I'm afraid I can't help you with that. That's what I thought, father. Oh, your stupidity is ever deep, father. So what can I do for you? To make you happy, Alex. Oh, never mind, father. You and mother have enough to worry about. Are you sure? Mm, well, there would be something, father. Yeah. Of course there is, tell me. You know how I always love playing the trumpet, father? Unfortunately, my trumpet was damaged in our... during our move. It sounds dented and terrible. Well, that's just because you don't know how to play it, son. Maybe you should keep practicing. The other day, I saw a trumpet, father, on display at the kiosk. It looks almost like new. But it'll, it's probably way too expensive, right, father? Well, I'll see what I can do. Okay. Ow. So, what are we doing here? Let's see if there... Oh, there is time. 71 hours to get to know the tenants. Uh-oh. Why is it jittering every time I go into a new room? That's annoying. Ah, I gotta fix the, the thing, Medding. Bills! I was clicking the laundry machine! You have received your first bill. In the course of the game, you'll receive bills again and again. Just like real life. The bills must be paid on time. Otherwise, you'll be in debt and lose the game. Yeah, I know that one. It may happen that the bills are too high for you to pay. Try to accumulate more money by creating profiles or helping the tenants, for example. What do I need to do here? It's telling me to... Oh, there's a rat. Rat, smart, social, and affectionate. However, many people have prejudice. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Items. You have received an item. Items can be stolen, bought, sold, or given. Items can contain information about the owner. Objects can be returned or repositioned in furniture. <coughs> returned, right? Totally not for blackmail. Why can't I fix this thing? Why does it keep telling me that I have to do this? Ah, that's so annoying. Oh well. Whoa, what's going on? Jesus, with the jittering. See, I need the new, I need the new computer. So I can empty this, but I can't fix the two things with the blur symbol. Now that's just weird. Okay, I need to get to know the tenants. Because uh, we're running out of time here. Tenants! What's this? Is that a pill on the... Oh, that's the, uh, the dism. I need to fix this. How do I fix it? Hi, who... Uh, Magnus, I already talked to you. I'm not interested in you. How do I... Oh, like that. I mean, that just funky. Um, you live in there. Okay, knock, knock. Wait, I'm, I'm trying to use the keyboard. Okay, I just walked in. Okay. Hello, I am Frank Swartz. I have arrived at your apartment. I would like to introduce myself briefly. My name is Frank Swatch. I am the new property manager. I'm glad to hear that. My name is Veckert. I would like to ask you a few questions about your apartment. Is everything in order and to your satisfaction in your apartment, Mrs. Veckert? Yes, thank you. Nice of you to ask. Now, please get the freak out of here. Do you live here alone? Dude, there, you, did you not look? Okay. No, of course not. What makes you think that? I live here with my husband and two children. Ida, Alfred, come here and say hello to Mr. Swatch. Hello, Mr. Swatch. I just teleported in. Are you a right boy? 
You need a tissue? Oh, thank you. Go on. Ah, oh, Mita took away my police costume. You're not supposed to wear one of those. If that were here, he would beat your ass blue. But he isn't here. He w won't be back soon either. He went for milk and cigarettes. Why is it bad to play in a police costume? That's very commendable. Quiet, children. Mr. Swartz isn't interested in all that. <laughs> we the police. Uh, I ain't know what he's talking about. Mr. Swartz, Alfred has a cold. We were just about to go to the pharmacy to get some medicine, weren't we, kid? <laughs> Where is it? Where is Mr. Beckert, if I may ask? And why isn't he coming back so soon? Uh, um, he's, um, traveling. Klaus is, um, on a business trip. Oh, a business trip, I see. But we really have to go now. Have a good day, Mr. Swatch. You too, Mrs. Beckert. Get well soon, Alfred. Gathering information. Frank can collect information about inhabitants of the, his house, uh, be it the possessions of items with, within dialogues or through conspicuous activities. This information is saved in the profile of the respective resident. At Frank's workplace, by creating profiles, you can report the information to the ministry. Okay, well. Okay, so she has a sick son. Who else is in there with you? Magnus, do you have anyone else in here? You again, what do you want? Nothing, goodbye. Apparently. We didn't have anyone on the third floor, right? We do. Holy bajoli. That's a lot of people to talk to. What if I go over here? I can't, okay. Well, up we go. <laughs> that was fun. Um, knock knock. Nope. This is what I want. Hi. I'd like to introduce myself. Good day. I'm the new property manager here. I would like to know the tenants a bit. Oh, well, I know that face. Frank. Frank Swartz. What are you doing here? Um, uh, uh have we met before? Frank Swartz, of course. Oh, I know the face. Okay. Walter Bullhauser. Bully. Oh, God, I'm not sure right now. Man, Frank, you forgetful bastard. We were colleagues back then in the archive, don't you remember? Well, of course, Walter, yes, uh, from the archives, right? I almost didn't recognize you. You are quite... You've changed quite a bit. Oh, why don't you just say that I've gotten fat? So what? A small belly is sexy, a sign of prosperity. But what are you doing here? I'm the caretaker here and look after things. So if you n ever need anything... Need? No, actually everything's fine. The heating gets stuck sometimes, but on the whole I'm happy. It's cheap here too. But what a coincidence, you and me in the same house and you're the caretaker here of all places. Strange, isn't it? Yes, what a coincidence. And what are you doing now? Are you still in the archives? I left that behind a long time ago. I'm now a case officer at the Department of Homeland Security. I'm working on travel reform projects. Oh, how interesting. Yes, yes, with the travels and whatnot. You definitely need to tell me more about that at some point. Tell me, do you smell something? Uh, it smells delicious. Oh, that smells good. What are you cooking? No, not delicious. Oh no, my pumpkin casserole is burning. I have to go. See you soon. So he's harmless. He's for now. This should be Wolf. Hi, Wolf. Hello, Mr. Hinker. You are Mr. Hinker, right? Ah, who are you? I'm the new property manager, Frank Swatch. Very pleased. Ah, the new gen to welcome. Hopefully you'll last a little longer than the other did. Do you know why he's not here anymore? The cops got him, man. You mean the police? No, I heard of wild cows with stun guns on their hooves. You better watch yourself. This place is crawling with informers. Uh, what nonsense. That's not true at all. Oh, yes, it is. It's shameful. We live in a state where you can't even trust your neighbors anymore. Trust nobody. 
Chaka. Well, I better keep my mouth shut now. See you around. But uh, you, do, didn't you have more people in the? Okay. Yet Alex a new trumpet. Give Sabine something for her wedding anniversary. 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 Uh, and get Kim a pet rat. Okay, so no one in there yet. That's good. And no one in there yet. That's also good. That's less people. People I have to deal with. New. New. That's that's actually funny. Okay. Well. Uh. Wait. What do I do now? Oh uh, wait, 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 wait. Do I need to do this now? Nope. Okay. Well. Okay. People are asleep. Seems like I am still in the uh, prospect of not needing sleep. Now we just need uh, to create a profile of everyone. Uh, profile. Uh, Mr. and Mrs. Uh, let's take... Hang on. Elizabeth first. Uh, she has a sick child. Send. Form accepted. Then we go back here on. Then we look at Magnus. Okay, so he lives alone. Oh, it changes automatically. That's nice. He's very rude. I'm gonna tell the ministry about you and your rudeness. Oh my god, I'm making so much money. And then we have Walter. Sent that. 51. A jovial, friendly man who works in an office. See. Oh, we did already meet Ulrich. Ulrich. Oh, I don't know. It's paranoid. Oh, he's a widow. Oh. Or cheeky and without decency acts, acts strangely. Is that all of them? Did I do my due diligence? I don't have anything on her. Nothing on him. I need to phone in my own family. Pioneer manager. Well, why don't you pioneer a wedding gift for yourself then? Instead of having me do everything for you. Uh, indirect communication. Talk to Sabine. Didn't I already? Task completed. Frank, it's good that you're here. I want to talk to you for a minute. What's it about, dear? Our money! Because of your demotion to janitor of this dump, I now have to try all the harder in my position as pioneer leader. Shouldn't you be paid well? As a CEO or a leader or whatever you want to call it? Property manager, thank you. Because with your ridiculous salary as house manager, we can barely make ends meet. Sabine, I... Listen to me, Frank! I spoke to my boss yesterday. He generously allowed me to work my extra shift in the future. From now on, I'll give you a part of my income every day for the joint household budget. In return, I expect you to take care of errands for the children in our apartment. Can you do that? Well, theoretically. But is it really necessary? The children need their mother. Therefore, mothers stay at home. Uh, well. And take care of the kids. Since you lost your job, the situation is tough, Frank. Because how are the children going to live? How are we going to buy them clothes and food and pay their school fees? Don't fool yourself, Frank. You can pay our bills alone anymore. You can't. You better be glad that at least I still have a career. Here, take the money and use it wisely. We cannot get waste any of it now. Thank you. I mean, isn't it only fair that... That she pays half, you know? I still need to talk to her? Frank, you have to talk to Kim. Why? Are you still worried about her behavior? Yes, that's why. Something's gotta change. Why? Because she's different? She has to adapt more. The clothes, the metal on her face, the hair. If she keeps this up, she'll end up in jail. She's screwing up her whole life and I was along with it. She's still young. Sabine, honey, I think you're being a little hard on her. She's a young... She is young and beginning to find her way in the world. Maybe she'll feel a little rejected by you if you keep that attitude up. Now Kim's behavior is my fault! I did 
I don't think I ever said that, but okay. No, honey, it's just, it's complicated. Kim is stubborn. She got it from you. How? Oh! Mm, you think? I always used to have difficulties with my mother. Maybe I'm really a bit hard on her. Maybe you can talk to her anyway about her style. I'm happy to do that, honey. Why do I need to talk to her about her style? She's fine. Uh, okay. I don't have anything to talk to you about. New task. The pusher? Excuse me? I just started and I'm already gonna have to deal with drugs? Pick up the phone. Pick up! There we go. Hey, here's Mr. Swatch. Swatch, we have an un unofficial assignment for you. Unofficially? What's this about? Penicillin is currently in short supply. I have read about it. Smugglers and bootleggers steal stock. Right. They are all spies, paid from abroad. They have the task of harming our great nation. Of course they did. Those bastards, right? We suspect a, that a resident of your home is one of these bootleggers. The, main, the man's name is Magnus Herman. He is said to specialize in trafficking penicillin and other drugs. And he steals it f uh, from those who desperately need it. Terrible. What do you want me to do? Bring us evidence that proves Herman's guilt, Swartz. That won't be so hard. Click. Burglary. Frank can break into other people's apartments. To do so, click on the door and on the door icon to get inside. Note that the inhabitants of the apartment may be at home. If you get caught, Frank will be kicked out of the apartment and an invoice will come in. Caution. Other residents can hear Frank better when he sprints. Okay, we're not going to sprint then. How do I pay that bill that I have? Bill? Nope. Ah! Uh, the uh, tab. Uh, the, no, that's just inventory. Uh, bills, bills. Uh, pay, pay, and pay. Just pay him, pay him as soon as we get him now. Can I buy a camera? These are the regulations. These are the files, my inventory, bills, and then my, uh, the things I have to do. Oh, God. Now I actually have to go out and buy things. I can't just do it in the right next to the house. I want a camera. I need a camera. Oh, what is this all about? There's nothing in the bush. I'm not allowed to use the subway without a ticket. Uh, okay, fine. Where do I get a ticket? Hi, uh, Walter. Oh, now you wanna talk to me? Okay, I'm coming. Uh, according to reports from the department, hostile foreign countries are blocking the Department of Homeland Security's purchase of penicillin. The drug is needed to treat rare cases of pneumonia among the population. Subversive elements in our society are trying in the most disgusting way to undermine morality in the country. Recently, they started rumors that there is a rampant pneumonia in the country. The resistance does not even hesitate to claim that there is a lack of penicillin in the country. The great leader proclaims to reassure the people, all is well. Um, these claims are untrue. Rampant pneumonia, no penicillin. There's a pandemic in the country and the Department of Homeland Security is sweeping it under the rock. The cases of pneumonia are no longer isolated incidents, as is being proclaimed, but a full-blown pandemic. At the same time, the ministry has failed to purchase penicillin to effectively treat the sick. The lives of our citizens are not worth a damn thing uh, to the authorities. Rise up. Ex... 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 Taras. I don't know. You okay? That's cool. Wait, I should talk to you first in case you also want something from the shop. Oh, I'm just walking. Oh, this is the Elizabeth. So get a bed in. Greetings, Mr. Swartz. Uh, how's Ida? How's your daughter Ida doing, Mr. Wickard? Oh, Ida is such a good girl. She is a great help to me with everything, even though she's still so young. How is the boy? No, it's terrible. Alfred has pneumonia. The pharmacy is out of penicillin. Alfred could die. I just don't know what to do. 
Uh, and what does your husband say about it? Is he finally back? My husband? Oh, Klaus uh, is still traveling. I don't expect him anytime soon. Shall I contact him for you? Send me send a message or make a phone call? No, uh, thank you, Mr. Swatch. That won't be necessary. If you really want to help us, get penicillin for my son Alfred. He's getting worse every day. Difficult. I'll ask around. Okay, so... Mm, we already dealing with the get medication for a child uh, prob problem. Is everything all right with you? Oh, as always, actually. Don't you miss your husband at all? I never see him here. Oh yes, this business trip is um, it is taking a little longer. But my kids are fine. You have to be grateful for the little things. Uh, okay. Whoa, whoa, game, come on. Why can't I fix these things yet? Okay, well, out we go. So I have 66 hours to talk to... Uh, uh, may I ask you something? If I may? If it can be avoided. How's your apartment? Is everything okay in there? Of course, what would be wrong with it? The faucet? Water comes out of the tap. Sometimes it is it is even clean. I'm glad to hear that. The hot water in the shower? Sometimes hot, sometimes cold. Just as it should be. I see. Good to hear. Anything else? The heater? The windows? Want me to take a look? No, everything's fine. Nothing you need to stick your nose into. Uh, regarding those penicillin deliveries, surely you've heard about the missing penicillin shipments plaguing our country, right? Spare me your state gossip. Can't you see that I have better things to do right now? So if it's absolutely necessary, come and see me, but only if it's really urgent. And now leave me to hell alone. Okay, well, good talk. Hmm. Hmm. Where is this shop? It's right here. That was easy. Hi, can I buy a camera? How are you doing here? Good day. What do you want? I uh, I just wanted to ask how you're doing here. I see. Good. It's always busy here, isn't it? Right? Of course it is. I'm having something to drink. If you know what I mean. That's what attracts people. Something to drink? You mean you sell alcohol? Yes, of course. There's no law against that. Right? Right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm um, sorry, I see. Uh, so, how long have you been standing here? All my life. Yeah, sometimes it seems that way, doesn't it? No, I've really always worked here. Have there been any incidents? Incidents? What do you mean about that? No, 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 no incidents here. Theft? Fights or something like that? Oh, you mean something like that? It happens here all the time. Some people drink too much. Uh, but I stay out of it. Out of it. Oh, oh, well done. If you don't mind, I'd like to buy something. What can we buy? Can I buy a camera? I can buy a manuscript. Work of fiction. There's the trumpet. Should I just get this now? I feel like I should just get this now. And then the tools too, I feel like. Let's get the trumpet, tools, and then a descaler and some heating oil. So I can fix the freaking apartment. Is there something here? Nope. Thank you, Mr. Kiosk man. Now I just need to figure out where to buy cameras from. Do I get them from the ministry? Or can I buy them somewhere? Ah, I want to talk to you. I haven't talked to you uh, specifically. You, Mr. Swartz. How's Alfred, Ida? Want to ask how Alfred is doing? Alfred is very sick. He's always coughing and just lying around. Can you help Alfred, Mr. Swartz? My mom is very sad. I'll try. I'll try my best, but unfortunately, I cannot promise you that I'll make it. Too bad, but maybe it'll work out. Alfred sucks, but I would be really sad if he was dead. Yeah, you know what? It's fair. How do I buy cameras? Uh, 
nothing there. I can't do anything there. I can't call someone. Where do I buy cameras? I want to get more cameras. Hang on. Uh, no, not that. Uh, okay, it's not this. Nope. I should read the regulate. Oh my god! Okay, abortion is illegal. Can't support the resistance. Sugar is banned. Foreign currency is banned. Uh, possession of knife is banned. Nonconformist, uh, homosexual statements, actions, and thoughts endanger the con continued existence of our nation. Forbidden. Oh boy. Okay, we are really totalitarian here. Um, importing exotic goods such as chocolate, possession of firearms, contact with people living abroad, apples. State documents. Apples are allowed. The red ones are allowed. The green ones are not. Uh, blue ties, nope. Rubber ducks are illegal. Foreign salt. Uh, you have to use light bulbs. You can't have any of them unused. Uh, fish consumption is prohibited. Hi. Uh, soda is banned. Owning and reading books is prohibited. Foreign music is prohibited. Dancing. Local medicine only. No jeans. Uh, Walkmans are banned. Private possession and hand handling of penicillin is uh, temporarily prohibited. Potentially planned conduct, violence, drugs. Demand money from another citizen. Offering sex service for money is reprehensible for moral and hygiene. Therefore, it's uh, prohibited. And crying cleanses the soul. For this reason, the great leader allows it. Okay. Uh, Alexander, I have something for you. No, I don't want to... I want to talk to yes, Alex. Uh, no, not you! Uh, go away. There we go. Alexander, I have a trumpet for you. You mentioned once that you wanted a new trumpet. Oh, did you bring me one, father? The Alexander, here's your new trumpet. Oh, father, you are the best. Thank you very much, father. With pleasure, my dear Alex. Now play nicely on it, too. I will. That's great, father. Okay, and I have a rat for you. Dad, I was just about to chill for a bit. Anything urgent? Uh, about the rat. We were talking the other day about the rat you want. Dad, don't tell me you brought me one. Kim, honey, here's your new pet. I'm going crazy! Dad, you really got me one. How cool. Although I still cannot understand what you see in these animals. The little snout and the cute paws. How can you not think they're cute, Dad? Well, I'm glad you're happy, Kim. Thanks, Dad. You are really cool. It's okay, it's okay, but don't tell your mother that I gave it to you, Jesus. Don't worry, Pop, the rat will be our secret. I won't rat you out, so to say. Also, uh, this can't go on, Kim. You two need to get on the same page. But, Dad! Kim, please listen to me. You and your mother need to talk to each other again, please. I want you to give a rat's ass about her. No, not your rat. It's a figure of speech. Can you meet her half well? <laughs> halfway, not half well. You can't meet mom halfway, dad. There are only two ways. The Sabine Swatch way or the wrong way. She hates me. She hates everything that I am. She doesn't hate you. Honey, what, uh, what makes you think that? Your mother is under a lot of pressure as being a pioneer leader. Um. You know what? No. She shouldn't change. Just stay the way you are. Be you. But I think you'll find the way you are, Kim. Please just be yourself. Thanks, Dad. I knew you'd stand by me. Now I'm gonna get yelled at by the wife. Okay, what do we have to deal with? Talk to Sabine. Who's Sabine? Alright. Who's Sabine? 
Santa Kim. Oh, that's my wife. Oh, God, I need to talk to her a lot. How do I get cameras? Gathering information, bills, task, metro, ministry, the stores. How do I get cameras? Uh, cameras. Click on the fire alarm. The camera can be removed. Yeah, but I need, I need to buy them. Hello? Uh, I guess I can only place the one the ministry sends to me. Oh, I already did this one. Okay. Wait, we can, we can hoist the flag here. Nope, there, there are no flags. Cool. Okay, let's go in and fix these things then. That we can do. I want to get cameras. And then we fix this. So I have to make a hundred dollars at least each day because I need to keep buying those things. Uh, fat hairy cockroaches. Well, I hope they're not illegal because I have a fat hairy... No, 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 no. We're being sober here. No. Um. But I think with this, we have sort of, uh, we've sort of done the introduction now. We know what we're into and it's so nice. Um, not to, again, not to shite on uh, Beholder 2, but it's so nice to see that we're back to this surveillance of tenants and placing cameras and being strategic uh, about it, uh, sort of gameplay. I'm really excited for that. Um, so yeah, but that was the first episode of Beholder 3. We'll head into it again tomorrow. I hope to see you there, but for now, thanks for watching. All right, I am out.